hi there welcome back to my channel today we're going to make it i am a she also known as a father stew this is my best favorite i don't know what other word to use for this stew but this is my most preferred stew ever if you want to know what i'm saying this wait and watch this video to the end so let's go into the recipe right now and start cooking so we have red well, peppers, red and green, then we have scotch bonnet pepper and onions, wash already sliced, ready to blend. I have chicken, I have ram meat, I have cooked beef and shaki, also known as tower, and I have eggs. This thing you have to cook it with egg, even though you are missing, honestly, you are missing. What I'm going to do is to boil my eggs. I like putting salt in my egg, I don't know if you guys put salt in your egg, let me know why. Me, I put it because I heard that it doesn't, the egg will not break, even if it cracks. It's not break, so I'm really happy that you're helping me so far. So once our egg is boiled, I'm going to be preparing to boil my chicken and my ram together because they get ready about the same time and they have the same consistency. I'm just going to be seasoning it up with chicken seasoning, ram seasoning, salt, curry, pepper, ginger and garlic, and that is just all here. Yeah. Put on fire to boil. You guys, I missed my recipe videos. I don't know why I stopped. Okay, I stopped because I don't know, I wasn't getting much views, so I just thought, but I really miss recipes videos, like, I miss cooking for you guys. But well, I'm back now, fully back, hopefully I'll be filming recipe at least twice in a month, or I'm not really sure yet, but let me know how you think, what do you think you want to see more, is it recipes, vlogs, or other videos? Let me know in the comment section, I'll be so happy to do all of that for you guys, honestly, I will. So once our meat is ready, I'm going to use blend our peppers and everything together and I'm just going to be using a bit of water, not too smooth if you want it, but me I'd like my own too smooth. I'm sorry for my voice, I had such a couple of days ago so it's not well healed yet but because I have to give you guys content so I'm here still trying to do the voiceover for this video. I feel a little bit better now, thank god, because I'm doing this video. I have more red peppers than the green one, which is not supposed to be so, but that was what I had and I had to just use it because I didn't want it to spoil it. Next thing I'm just pouring it inside of a pot to be boiling. I usually put my, I usually put small out then add many ones to the already liquidified, the liquid form already blended so I, just, so I don't put too much water in my blending. I also want it thick, I don't want it watery at all. So once everything is ready, I'll just put it into a pot to let it boil and also for the water to be used, you can really fry it well. I'll put a bit of water in my blender to rinse the peppers, but you can skip that. It's okay. So now I'm going to peel in my eggs. They've been in water, in cold water for a while now. I don't know if you guys ever noticed that when you don't put your eggs in cold water immediately, to, to peel is always hard. It's hard to peel. I don't know why. But I'm always doing that, so <laughs> I don't want to start stressing over egg, and I want it not. I don't want to move it and maybe part of nine move from the egg. No, I want it to be full and whole, so everybody can have one full egg. <laughs> anyway, if you're new to my channel, thank you for tuning in. My name is Gloria. I don't know if I said it before. My name is Gloria. I am a food and lifestyle blogger based in Abuja, Nigeria. Hello, my channel. Thank you for tuning in. I'm so happy you tuned in today on this recipe i hope you try it out and let me know how it was for you in the comment section so next thing i'm doing is to heat up my pan add some palm oil because i'm going to use the palm oil to make this thing please are doing this thing in fact can you do it outside what if you do it outside your house because palm oil it is something that's going to smoke everywhere in your house and you can co really cover it and let it do for about five minutes i made a mistake with the timer so i brought it back again five to seven minutes depending on the size of your fire how fast your gas is to burn so covering it so it not to uh, bring out the smoke too much just really helps it to steam steam the smoke inside the frying pan alone so but please don't do this when you're a child don't do this alone and if you're an adult please don't let your children be here close to it when you're doing this you understand so i'm just bringing out my meat which i'm already finished bringing it out and i'm leaving this stuff i'm going to use this is the stuff i'm going to use to make this sauce no water this is what I'm going to be adding. So I like cutting my meat so that everybody can take a meat with their spoon. I like that when, when, when I give you a sauce, you should have the egg, you should have about four to five meats inside your plate so that the meat will just be flowing, you know, to flow very, very well. <laughs> Please, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. This is the only way I'll be able to know whether you guys like such content. Please share my video to everyone around you, share it on social media. Your platform or your platform now. Meat is ready and eggs is ready. 
also by this time i've already off the oil since you guys saw that the steam that came out from this thing was still plenty and i all this to like 15 minutes ago then 15 minutes ago so it would get cold and but i didn't open it until now so i let me just being extra like gloria obviously i like frying my meat a little bit so it doesn't get too soft inside the meat especially the chicken i don't like my chicken pete pete inside the sauce so you know it's going to soak the sauce it's going to soak the sauce so that is why but well, this is optional i can skip this stage if you wish but for me this is a very very important stage for me because i don't like i also because i don't like that so as i was saying before please share my, my videos on all your platforms let me know comment share like subscribe and all those good things i'll be i'll be glad if you can do that for me so that's just it i guys after this just us to just pour in your pepper which is already boiled is already dried at this stage i only add coffee but totally forgot about coffee for this sort of which was wrong which is a very very important factor of this sauce <laughs> very very important but i forgot but it's it it's all good i can always add it when i want to eat it which i later did so you can cover this to steam and um, to fry i mean for a couple of minutes you guys that we fry for a couple of minutes now i'm just going to be adding my meat stock so that i can start cooking and start giving this thing flavors flavor what is all about flavors i'm going to be adding my eggs now because i like putting my eggs early so that they can they can suck in the flavors of this sauce so i'm going to put my eggs and after that i'm going to like to steam for some couple of minutes and i'll pour in my meat again my meat then i like to steam for a couple of minutes too in fact this sauce was missing two important things not just one the crayfish and dawa dawa which is also called iwi in yoba that is locust beans you just just take this off to the neck but i didn't have so i couldn't just kill myself for nothing but it was still good and tasty and was still okay honestly i really enjoyed it my family enjoyed it you can always i like making this sauce at least four hours before we eat it this was a sauce i made for the next day so i added some black pepper because there was not enough pepper i also wanted to give it more flavor and i added some seasoning cube and some salt and i stayed together please put your seasonings and your pepper to your own taste i will just eat for my own taste so that is it basically i like to steam for a couple of minutes and that is all the sauce is ready i my family really enjoyed this sauce to be honest so that is it for this video this recipe i hope you enjoyed it please if you do give it a thumbs up comment share and i love you guys stay safe stay calm go to the back bye for now see you guys in my next video bye